All right. Got another box open here, man. Got sent to me. This is from uh, J Nail. J and then nail like a hammer and a nail. He uh he's been a follower for a good while. He actually lives in Mississippi, way up north of me. And he contacted me the other day. Well, I say way up north. I think it's full. Cool, that's only about 75 miles from here. Is all. So he contacted me and he wanted to send me some stuff here. Let's see what it is. I got two shirts crammed in this thing, man. Look at this. All right, there's the front. And then there's the back right there. You know, see that? Nailed excavating. Hey, uh, he's on Facebook with me and uh, he posts a good bit of good stuff. I've communicated with him there uh, several times and and uh, it's pretty cool. So he got that color, the gray. And then he got me a high vis one too here, man. Same thing on the back, nail excavating. <laughs> That's pretty dang cool. Let's see, you got me a envelope here. Let's see what's in it, man. Got a note. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> We all hear that. That's that 03 out there running, man. Churning. See that? You got a dishwasher, new microwave hood, and a freezer. Got to put all that in this weekend. Our, some of ours is doing microwaves. All is is not. It's giving us a good bit of trouble right now. So I just went and got some more. Listen to that thing out there purring. Oh, she'll hit 400,000 miles today. She'll be on the way back from uh, from the woods this afternoon. She'll roll over 400,000. I'll get it on video when she does it. Yeah. There's Chad with a drag. Somebody said they... Somebody said they like to hear that thing running. I do too. That thing, uh, that thing's pretty cool to listen to it. So he's gonna grab him a lot of that brush right there. Those are the tops off of Kevin. And he's gonna take them back down there, either in a wet spot or on a hill to cover. You see how much he grabbed at that one time with all that, and he's going back down there with it. Like I said, to use it as a mat or uh, or something else. That's what he's doing. So today is uh, today's Thursday, and I'll just kind of give you a little quick update about my truck. My truck, it's a transmission. The transmission didn't go compl completely out or nothing like that. Got something else wrong in it. They told me, but there's some kind of technical terms and stuff like that, which doesn't matter. They're going to fix it. They couldn't fix it in Columbus, though. They ended up having to take it to another dealer up in uh, Tupelo, which is about an hour north of, of us here, to get it fixed. They took care of all that. Yes, the truck's going to be fixed under warranty. The truck has got a, the powertrain warranty on it. I think it's a 100,000 mile powertrain warranty on it. And then we bought extended warranty on top of that when we bought the truck. So the truck's got plenty of warranty. I ain't worried about it, nothing like that. But the dealer, I know they're embarrassed because they don't have no mechanic. They run over 120 vehicles a day through that service department there. They don't have a mechanic at all they can handle doing that job on that truck that needs to be done to it. And uh, which they should have three ACE mechanics per vehicle brand, you know, Chevrolet, GMC, and Dodge, and Chrysler, and all that stuff. 
they should have three ace mechanics per brand working at that dealer. Uh, I don't know why they don't or anything like that. Bought the truck local so I wouldn't have to drive somewhere if it did have problems. And uh, that's why I bought it local. And uh, But they're taking care, they took care of getting it up there. Uh, let me state this too. The truck does not have a Dodge transmission in it. That truck, when you order a truck, you have options. You have some transmission options. That truck has an Ison transmission in it. That is the best transmission money can buy. Obviously, I've got a little issue with it. Yeah, it'll get it worked out. Anytime you get something new, you can have a few bugs on it and stuff like that, you know? No biggie. But it's got the Ison transmission to get it in that truck is a $2,500 option. So you got that, got that going on. But they'll get it they'll get her fixed up and all that stuff but uh so we'll uh i'm not sure the time frame uh they want me in one of their trucks i was they wanted me to come up there yesterday and get one of their trucks and drive it and uh i couldn't do it yesterday i had too much stuff going on yesterday evening to uh to get that done i went and picked those appliances up and, and got that taken care of and got them back home so I could not there was no way I could get up there to get uh, get another vehicle picked up or anything like that uh, so uh, maybe I'll get up there this afternoon I'm not sure how long it'll take to get mine fixed but I'll kind of give y'all little updates you know throughout as, as it's going on because I'm not gonna just you know every video be about that truck or whatever like that I will say this we got we got two 2012 uh, GM products, both of them are Duramaxes with the Allison's in them, Allison transmissions in both of them. Uh, they've got about 70,000 miles on them now. They stay in the shop a lot, y'all. We have a lot of problems with them. Uh, you can't get into either one of those trucks, I don't think. Well, I know my dad, you can. I don't know about Derek's, but every time you get in, my dad's crank it up, check engine lights on and that thing. And uh, uh, Fords ain't, Fords ain't no better. You know, it, it doesn't matter what you, what you get the stuff costs a lot of money and uh and you know and that's that you can see jeff he's way over there on the wide tires get her bring a drag a pretty good drag behind him there gonna bring it across that that bottom there coming back up to kevin some of these places like this and these hills and this rough ground, you're limited on where you can set up and how you can set up and everything. Sometimes you just gotta pull the wood a little ways to uh, to get it to you. But uh, y'all be good, if you like my stuff, please subscribe to me. Uh, you can find me on uh, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, all of those are Cotton Top 3. C-O-T-O-N-T-O-P, just with one T on it. And uh, and all that of course i'm on facebook too i don't do anything on facebook other than just share my videos on facebook and that's about it so y'all have a uh, good rest of the week tomorrow will be friday uh, i may or may not do a giveaway tomorrow i'm not sure y'all be paying attention i'm not sure that i'm going to but anything's possible be paying attention there may be something embedded in the video there uh question that you can answer but uh y'all be good be safe and uh we'll talk we'll see y'all tomorrow friday morning later taters